Hola amigos! I am here to do a review on a mask. It has been forever since I have done a review of any sort. I've been doing a bunch of thrift hauls, so this is something different for all my new subscribers. I do a lot of mask reviews because I absolutely love masks. I feel like your face just needs to be treated every once in a while. It goes through a lot. Yes, I am hashtag no makeup. Today's Friday, so no makeup Friday. It's all washing everything. It's a little bit dry because I haven't put any moisturizer yet because I am going to do a mask. So this review is on the John Pierre Cosmetics Delicious Collagen Mask in Apple. And I did get this at my local TJ Maxx for $2.99. Apparently, upon uh, doing some research here and there just to see where you can get it, in Europe they have a TJ Maxx of sorts, but it's TK Maxx. So, uh, sorry, my hair is busted as hell. <laughs> I keep looking at it. So I believe you can get this online as well. I can't find it on Amazon. It doesn't have a price tag of anything. I wanted to give it a try because it's in this this container that's very very different. So call it delicious collagen mask. So I just wanted to go ahead and give you guys some information before we go ahead and start reviewing this. So collagen is the main structural protein found in skin and other other connective tissues. Widely used in purified form for cosmetic sur surgical treatments. Vitamin C plays a vital role in formation of collagen. There. Has, I believe the mixer is what it is. So how to use fill or let's see here. I didn't really find much as far as like what it claims to do. The directions to use is fill the bowl to inside the line. There's that. If rubber pack is ready, apply rubber except eyes, lips, and nostrils. Apply after 15 to 20 minutes after application, remove rubber pack from your face. Pack to chin, cheek, nose, forehead, water. And then number, this is weird. The directions are very, like, not translated very well in English. Okay, so apparently it goes from fill the bowl inside to if rubber pack is ready, but number two is at the bottom. Using spatula, mix evenly and quickly. So there is that. This is how much product you get. It says it is 1.05 ounces. Okay, so uh, apparently you just add water, mix it, put it on your face, and then peel off. So it's a peel off, not a wash off. Okay, so uh, let's get started. Ooh. Ooh. It smells pretty good. What it says to do is fill it up to the line, so let me go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and mix this baby. The consistency is quite different. It looks like it is a blue color. Now it's super watery. I don't quite know if it's supposed to gelatinize or what the dealio is, but that is what that looks like right now. Alrighty, I think this is as good as it's going to get, guys. So uh, let's go ahead and apply this, but you can see it's still very watery okay let's apply this I couldn't find legit instructions on how to apply it like if this is still if this is okay to apply like this like look how watery it is still so I don't know but I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it because it looks pretty well mixed Ugh, what the heck why does that look so weird okay Camille it's not white. It's it's like a light blue, but I don't know if this is how you're supposed to apply it or what the dealio is, but it's the only way that I can apply it, I guess. I am done applying it. I have this much left. Like, I barely had to apply any. Application sort of sucks because if you're solely depending on this to apply the mask you will be here forever so halfway through this video i actually started just using my fingers just because i felt like i could get more coverage and i can just feel where it's needed after i applied my whole face i started just dabbing like little little spots here and there because i know i'm gonna have to peel this off so i just want to make sure that it is evenly as well as it's thick enough so it doesn't just break off little by little because i hate masks where they just break off little by little initial 
application process I'm not a big fan of just because it's heck of watery like I don't know if I added too much water or if I was supposed to wait for it to like gelatinize a bit but it doesn't smell quite like apple it smells like watered down toothpaste so it's a little and it's blue I don't know if you guys can tell it's hope it's hope yay perfect yes 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 it's blue okay so it says here that we are going to be waiting 15 to 20 minutes after application and i'm guessing until it dries and then that's when we go ahead and peel it off so yeah all right i will see you guys uh in 20 minutes all right update because i can't really talk it's starting to dry into like this really like i don't know how it's going to feel but i really can't move my face the dry spots are what's dry I have to wait for the rest of the stuff to dry, but it's feeling like I don't know how it's gonna peel, to be honest. You see it? It's like a... I don't know. Alright, just wanted to do an update. It's been about 10 months. And along that same line, after 10 minutes, the watery consistency of the mask itself has now gelatinized. So, uh, yeah. It's all gelatinized. Alright guys, my face, I really can't move it. My face is very stiff. Um, it's getting a little itchy, but it's been about 20 minutes, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. I don't think this can peel, to be honest. Like, like it's like cracking, so I don't even know if it's like peel, like if it's gonna peel. What the actual F? Let me read the directions again. Hey guys, I give up. Um, I don't think this is a peel off mask, so I'm just gonna wash my face. I'll be right back. Hey guys, so I just got done washing my face. So I went online because as you saw my struggle in the earlier clip, as far as it being a peel, peel off mask, uh, no, it's not. I don't know what I did wrong. I don't know if I was supposed to wait for it to set and gelatinize before I went ahead and started applying, but I applied it right off the bat. I waited 20 minutes and it got really hard and I was like, well, that's weird. Like, why would it get that hard when you're going to peel it off your face, you know? So as you saw, I tried to peel it off and it just came off in pieces, like really hard pieces. So I had to just go ahead and wash it off. And I checked the directions again on the on some website that I found and it said that yeah it is a peel off mask but I don't understand. <laughs> this is now the things that I put on my face. It's very gelatinized now. Like it's like jello. It's legit like jello. I think I was supposed to wait for it to set a little bit. I'm a little sad now but it is what it is. Uh, as of right now, I am not a fan of this. I am very disappointed. I've been saving this up. My face feels alright. Uh, it doesn't feel much different. It's a face mask. Uh, it's not instant gratification as far as like how your face feels and everything. But yeah, I'm gonna go and put some toner, moisturizer, and go about my day. Alright, well, I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos by me, click that subscribe button. It would totally make my day, and I will see you guys later. Bye!